What Do You Do With a Chance? Written by Kobe Yamada, illustrated by Mae Besson. One day I got a chance. It just seemed to show up. It acted like it knew me as if it wanted something. I didn't know why it was here. What do you do with a chance, I wondered. It fluttered around me. It brushed up against me. It circled me as if it wanted me to grab it. I started to reach for it, but I was unsure and I pulled back. And so it flew away. I thought about it a lot. I wish I had taken my chance. I realized I had wanted it, but I still didn't know if I had the courage. When another chance came around, I wasn't so sure, but I decided to try. I went to reach for it, but I missed it and fell. I was embarrassed. I felt foolish. It seemed like everyone was looking at me. I decided I never wanted to feel this way again. So after that, whenever a chance came along, I just ignored it. And the more I ignored them, the less they came around. Until one day, I noticed that I hadn't seen a chance in quite a while. It was as if they had all disappeared. I started to worry. What if I don't get another chance? I know I acted like I didn't care, but the truth was I did. I still wanted to take a chance, but I was afraid. And I wasn't sure if I would ever be brave enough. Then I thought, maybe I don't have to be brave all the time. Maybe I just need to be brave for a little while at the right time. I realized it was up to me. I promised myself that if I ever got another chance, I wasn't going to hold back. If I got another chance, I was going to be ready. Then, one seemingly ordinary day, I saw something shining far off in the distance. Is it possible? I hope. Could this be my chance? I had to find out. I ran as hard and as fast as I could towards it. I don't know how to explain it, but the second I let go of my fears, I was full of excitement. It wasn't that I no longer was afraid, but now my excitement was bigger than my fear. As I got closer, I could see that this really was a huge chance. But this time I was ready. As it came by, I reached out and grabbed it. I held on with all my might. It felt so good to soar, to fly, to be free. I now see that when I hold back, I miss out. And I don't want to miss out. There's just so much I want to see and do and discover. So what do you do with the chance? You take it. Because it just might be the start of something incredible.